when individuals provide data, which we do all the time, anybody who has an iPhone, um, all kinds of ways that we're, we kind of leave this kind of digital exhaust and all kinds of things we do, there's huge questions about who has access to it, according to what standards, um, and both domestically and also internationally. And um, the law hasn't um, really begun to address this in a, in a systematic way, and it's not entirely clear what the right answer is, because one could say, well, we should give notice to consumers about where their data is and therefore who gets access to it. But realistically, most consumers are not going to be paying the kind of detailed attention to, the, to who has access to it and to what those rules are that would make any sort of choice or consent meaningful. And so what's really needed is the development of minimal standards, procedural protections that will ultimately protect all of our data and all of our privacy, um, regardless of where it's held or for what purposes it's been.